Hey Ninjas, Constantine here. If you guys follow me on the internet by now, you probably know that I have a boyfriend and I think he's just the coolest guy in the whole world. He's smart and smarter than me. He's handsome and sexy and cool. Uh, and he's into all the same things I'm into. Um, and he also has a really massive collection. And when I first saw it, I, it actually made me like him more because it's just, it's incredible the things that he has in his apartment. But his apartment is a little bit messy and we have sort of decided that it's time to organize everything. So one, we know what we have in the apartment and two, certain people can come and visit us without, I don't know, feeling like we live in a house that's like sort of a mixture of a frat house and a toy store that has exploded. So let's take a look really quick at the not clean version. <laughs> So, here in the apartment, when you come in, you know, we have the table of like sort of CDs, people still own CDs, alcohol, uh, video games, the uh, Mighty Mugs collection here, uh, Transformers and wrestling figures, and Lots of, lots of piles. I'm actually like this too. Uh, in my room, I pile things. That's what I think is organized, but just like lots of things and piles, toys and stuff. Lots of uh, video game things are gonna need to get organized. I actually uh, organized this a lot last week, so this is a little bit better than it was before, but you can just see stacks of comics. We've got, you know, like, bigger compilation issues, and we've got just bagged and boarded single issue comics just in stack. The Nerf gun weapon section over here. The TV that I don't think has uh, been dusted in uh, ever, I'm not even sure. Um, here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, yeah, and I don't know, uh, this is where people sit when they come over and watch Monday Night Raw. There's stuff in here. I'm not even, oh, oh, more Mighty Mugs. That's a surprise. That's a surprise. <laughs> if you go back over here, we're back by the entrance. You can see all of the more like WWE wrestling stuff right over here. Um, Moving over into the living room area, DVDs, more collectibles, helmets. Uh, and honestly, and on moving into the living room area, we've got DVDs. And honestly, I've, I've never, honestly, I've never even like seen what is in here, so I have no idea. That'll be interesting to find out what's underneath all of this. So we'll figure that out. <laughs> um, more WWE figures underneath the Hello Kitty head. Um, some line art, some comics up here on the wall. Over here. Um, and then going into his bedroom. More sort that I won't show you guys what's in there. Again, like. I started organizing all of this yesterday. Uh, so if you, in a way it's more messy, but then in a way it's cleaner than what it was before. You can also, you can see that right here. Yesterday this whole area was covered, but again, you know, bag and border comics, comic books, um, more comics here. And then I'll let, it's cleaner than it was before too, in a way. Uh, I don't know, it's messier and yet cleaner at the same time, but the closet is what I spent a lot of time doing yesterday. A lot of this just got organized yesterday, but there's even more clothes down there that need to be folded. And I've started um, organizing all of the toys uh, that are in boxes still in their original packaging by, by type, by like series, but then also like the, the toy type. So we've got like Transformers um, Generations and uh, lots of Marvel stuff, lots of DC stuff, as you can see. All of the comics are gonna sort of get reorganized in a way so that uh, my boyfriend, when he's like, where's Scott Pilgrim Volume 5? I thought that I owed this. He'll actually know where it is because we rediscovered that yesterday. 
Um, and again, over here. Just uh, more toys everywhere. Toys in the showcase, display case, um, and uh, even more toys, stuffed animals, like, I'm not sure why. Why it was necessary to buy three giant elephant stuffed animals, but it's a Gatorade bottle that I don't know how long that's been there, uh, and, and stuffed animals, and I don't even know. Who knows? I'm going to have to find out, right? Like, it's got some stuffed elephant animals. They needed a home. They were on clearance. No one wanted them. But yeah, so this is a look into uh, the coolest apartment in the room in the world, and soon to be the even more coolest apartment in the room after I get done organizing everything. So I hope you guys like this video, and I hope you guys like the end result too. All right, ninjas been five days like literally five days I started on Thursday and now it is Tuesday we finished last night on Monday there's still a few things left that we have to do but I want to show you the uh, apartment which Meredith has dubbed uh, nerd castle that's what she called it right nerd castle yeah so here we go nerd castle aka Fort Awesome okay. so here are the apartments the entryway is still messy uh, we've got boxes for like shipping stuff that gets sold on eBay and everything like this right here But yeah, I mean uh, There's still some books and and single issue comics that need to be put into long boxes But yeah, so all of these new shelves, which I assembled and carried in on my own uh, We have regular books that are not comics uh, literature um, Comics CDs whatever these are uh, Mighty Mugs, they were made in the same place. More Mighty Mugs and the Transformers that all got dusted. More shipping boxes, or long boxes. But in here we have lots of like uh, DVD box sets just of things. The X-Files, very cool. The OC, not as cool. Ugh. Oh, for you. All right, and then uh, another uh, new shelf right here. It's the uh, manga shelf predominantly. Uh, some random collector's edition video games over here. Uh, bigger boxes of uh, toys. And literally this whole table is just uh, figures and toys that have not been unboxed yet. So uh, like extremely massive uh, Marvel Universe collection. Uh, almost everything, I think. Um, some DC stuff as well. Try to keep them separate from one another as much as possible. Uh, and this thing, this is just like instructions, mostly for Transformers. Um, but yeah, then over here, this all got straightened out. I dusted it, so it's not gross anymore. Uh, this is also new, I brought this in. Um, video games and Blu-rays. I'll come up from Street Fighter. Yep. Uh, when people come over and hang out, this is the couch that I sit on. That's so fun. And then moving further into the apartment, I clean the kitchen, but there's nothing really super interesting in there. But over here, again, uh, just more toys in boxes. A lot of uh, Batman figures, masterpiece Transformers. Uh, and then this uh, expedite shelving, I brought this in from Ikea as well. Uh, I think I showed you guys the clip of um, how I transported all of this stuff in my car, which is not very big. It was probably illegal. And if I had gotten in a car accident, I most certainly would have been decapitated. But yeah, so again, yeah, just nothing uh, but toys. Toys, toys, toys. Down here in these boxes, toys and stuffed animals. Uh, DJ Pony. The San Diego Comic Con exclusives from this year. The Deadpool Taco Truck. Um, DVDs, which I suppose will have, the DVDs will eventually get phased out and replaced by Blu rays. Kind of sucks that you always have to do that, right? Like it was VHS, now it's DVDs, and now it's Blu rays and everything. These need to either be sold or boxed. 
in here, this stuff got all cleaned. So board games, things to sell, Snuggies. Uh, my boyfriend has a really massive collection of Snuggies that he refuses to get rid of any of them. Uh, more Snuggies, uh, more board games, some uh, random comics. The room where we keep the dead bodies. Laundry. Um, miscellaneous things. So like electronics, PlayStation, tools. Down here, uh, actually these two shelves down here, there's nothing but um, weird Halloween costumes, like old Halloween costumes that, again, I tried to throw away, but was not allowed. Um, and like uh, the swag bags from cons, we have a lot of those cloth, cloth swag bags and we can't really bring ourselves to get rid of them because they usually have cool things like Batman on them. So we just put them in there. Uh, and then, yeah, Howard's room. Uh, my friend Meredith uh, is visiting this weekend, so there are suitcases in here, but I mean, look at this. You guys remember what it looked like uh, five days ago, AKA a minute ago when you saw it in the video? Like there were comics stacked here, there were comics stacked here. Uh, we didn't even, I didn't even, it took me a, a couple months to realize that this even existed in here. This was nothing but wrestling figures. Um, hats, right? But like, seriously, look, I can lay on the floor. Uh, I can roll on the floor. Uh, okay. Uh, I was distracted. The closet isn't really done yet because it's nothing but clothes in a big pile. But once we get these clothes sorted out, it'll be good up there. But I, the reason I'm bringing it into the closet, even though it's not finished, is because, oh, look at that cami. What? No one cares about you, Zangie. Go away. Um, but yeah. Oh, and there are also more uh, DVDs and video games in this closet. Um, And uh, again, you know, uh, my boyfriend still needs to go over through that, but we'll walk over through here and uh, we'll find some stuff and animals got sorted out. And um, and the bathroom also got cleaned, but no one really cares about kitchens and bathrooms because there aren't everything in there. But anyway, that's what I spent the last five days doing, cleaning this awesome apartment. Uh, and now I'm happy to say that people can come and visit us here and not be horrified um, at the nerd hoarder e is a me is a bit is a, ugh, I can't even talk whatever but yeah now people can visit us now we know what's in the apartment and now that I've cleared up a lot of floor space I suppose my boyfriend can buy more things to put on the floor right. but anyway that's all leave a comment below and uh, I don't know watch my other videos <laughs>